to all of you on this independence day the monsoon has been very good this year i want to congratulate all our farmers farm laborers brothers and sisters because after many years we have had such a good monsoon on this day we have to think of the future also on the one hand we have to see how to take the country towards prosperity and how we have to carry our people forward on the other hand we have to ponder over the difficulties we have emerged out of and how we can improve things in future when we look back over the last 4 years one thing that we notice is the economic improvement in the country <coughs> that the monsoon was very bad a few years ago then there was drought some years ago and last year's drought was the worst in living memory yet the country steadily moved forward last year we fought the situation with all our strength the government of india had paid early attention to it and initiated strong measures our effort was to see that as far as the drought was concerned we should not bring our politics into it and that our attention should be focused on the people who were suffering and needed relief we devoted last year to this and our entire attention was concentrated on those people india came out of this trouble and the pace of our development did not halt although it slowed down a bit we moved forward and with strength the world was a witness to how india faced the situation and it realized that india had become a strong country capable of facing major calamities the world also realized that the world also realized that there is nothing that can suppress india or stop it from forging ahead i want to congratulate all those who put their shoulders to the job of meeting the challenge irrespective of the fact whether they were in politics administration or in any voluntary organization above all i would like to congratulate our farmers and farm laborers who faced the problem with determination as i said even though the country was suffering under drought its pace of development could not be halted the country moved ahead even under those conditions the performance of our infrastructure was very good likewise the process of industrialization continued at a fast pace and we did not allow it to falter for the first time the country came out of such a difficult period and the pace of development did not suffer also we did not go to others asking for financial assistance that we were able to achieve this is a matter of great pride we were able to do it because of the work done by our great leaders during the last few years the result of which we see today even while passing through difficult times there was no slackening of our attention towards the weaker sections 
letter dated 10th August 1992 from Rama Enterprises Madras to Rao and Company Kakinada Dear sirs we are in receipt of your letter of the 8th August as you are aware we have been manufacturing and selling domestic appliances since a long time we are enclosing here with a catalog of our goods and price list and we shall be glad if you select the articles that you desire to purchase from us and place the necessary order with us we assure you that on receipt of your order we shall take necessary steps to supply them to you at an early date normally the goods will be supplied to you within 2 weeks from the date of receipt of order as a special case we shall try to supply goods required within a week from the date of receipt of order one of the terms and conditions of sale is that if any one of the goods are found damaged or found out of order we shall be pleased to supply fresh ones in their place at our cost but such things should be brought to our notice within a week from the date of receipt of the goods by you yours faithfully